Police say a passerby was walking in this area when they saw a man unresponsive under the bridge, and that's when they called police. The medical examiner was able to look at the injury and was able to confirm that uh, it's possible homicide. On Tuesday, Stillwater police say 32 year old Travis Chapman was found dead under this bridge along East Virginia Avenue. Authorities couldn't say what his injuries were yet, but they suspect foul play. I didn't want to believe it was true. Friends and family say they're in shock. We didn't think that anyone would want to hurt Travis ever. He never had any enemies like that. Elizabeth Hansen has known Travis since elementary school. She tells me he was homeless and his mental health prevented him from working. It's kind of sickening because he's one of my best friends and it's just hard to convince myself that I will never see him walking because he didn't deserve it. He's a good he's a good person and a really good friend. Neighbors who live near the bridge say it's been a problem in the past. In the past couple of years there's probably been three people. Uh, two of them I know that was homeless. Please say three people have died under the bridge in recent years, but this is the only homicide investigation. But I hope that we just we find out who did it so we can give Travis justice.